Hello my friend, it is I, Vadim. I have huge news about Intel Z desktop graphics cards for you today. In this video, I want to show you why I think that Intel is ready to launch desktop graphics cards soon. Also, I will go over everything we know about these GPUs so far, specs, performance, etc. So, why do I think that Intel is about to launch desktop graphics cards? Yesterday the company posted a teaser video you are seeing right now. It shows the ZLP logo that represents Intel's mobile graphics morph into the ZHPG logo, which is the name for their desktop graphics cards. But that is not all. There is a hidden code in this video that points to this web page that says welcome to the ZHPG scavenger hunt. The event will launch on March 26th at 9am PST. I believe that Intel is launching its desktop graphics card marketing campaign to build up hype before the product launch. FYI, Intel CEO Pat Gelsinger is hosting a webcast on March 23rd, just three days before the scavenger hunt begins. So we may get some more clues to what is going on during that presentation. I will be keeping a close eye on this story. Hit like and subscribe to make sure that you don't miss any important news. Here's what we know about Intel Z desktop graphics cards at the moment. The latest leaks indicate that there will be a total of 6 GPUs. The most powerful one was recently spotted on the Geekbench database, tested as part of the system equipped with Intel 12th Gen Alder Lake CPU. This top GPU features 512 execution units and may come with either 16 or 8GB of GDDR6 memory across a 256-bit bus. In terms of performance, it may be close to or exceeding the likes of RTX 3070 and RX 6700 XT. The next one down the stack will have 384 execution units and 12 or 6 GB of memory with a 192-bit bus. GPU model with 256 EUs may have 8 or 4 GB of memory and is most likely targeting the higher tier of 1080p gaming. The rest of the lineup will have 192, 128 and 96 execution units with just 4 GB of GDDR6 memory and focus on lower tier 1080p gaming. According to the Reuters report, Intel's first desktop GPU manufacturing may be outsourced to TSMC's 7nm node. Another possibility is Intel's in-house 10nm node. There is still a lot we don't know, so stay tuned for more info. What are you expecting from Intel Z GPUs? Enter the discussion with me in the comments below. It was I, Vadim, until next time.